For Uganda to end HIV infections by 2030, the country has to attain the 95% target set by the World Health Organization for people to know their status. This can only be achieved if all age groups are tested for HIV. With the 2030 mark just six years away, the Ministry of Health has launched a national campaign it has called Munonye to identify children and adolescents aged between 0 to 19 years with HIV starting April till September this year. So for this campaign, we are going to be working mainly at the facilities and also in the communities. At the facilities, we are going to engage our healthcare providers uh, to line list uh, children of clients who are already living with HIV, who attend our clinics, but for one reason or another, their children are not yet uh, tested, and so we do not know their HIV status. Apart from identifying children and adolescents with HIV, it will also start them on treatment. By October this year, we are expecting uh, a, a pill that we think is going to be a big uh, game changer in terms of adherence, especially for the adolescents who struggle with taking their pills. It's going to be one pill that contains three different drugs. Permanent Secretary Dr. Dana Twine says it is important that all pregnant mothers attend antenatal care so that the information about their status and their yet to be born children is captured. We need to talk about antenatal attendance. And once our mothers attain antenatal care, we are 100% sure that they will be tested and those that are positive will be taken care of so that we have normal babies. According to the Ministry of Health, over 60,000 children and adolescents are being treated for HIV AIDS. Raymond Tamale, NTV. <laughs>